Hi, this is Kelly from Car Data Video, and what we're going to look at today is the totally new 2009 Honda Pilot uh, SUV. Though this Pilot is very reminiscent of the previous model years, it actually is totally new from front to back. The critics will occasionally fuss at Honda because they're very timid in their styling, but you have to remember this is a company of engineers and they're much more into functionality than they are into pretty and stylish. Notwithstanding that, the new Pilot is an awfully nice looking vehicle. And is also fun to drive as you can see here. The Pilot is a mid-size SUV with an almost large SUV interior space. It's a healthy size, about 4,300 pounds. And comes as an 8 passenger, 3 rows of seat vehicle. It's been a very popular vehicle over the years not so much for the way it looks but for the way it functions. It is uh, smaller than a large SUV. It uh, is different from minivan but yet it offers families that have children and stuff tremendous amount of flexibility and reliability uh, in the vehicle. This is a reasonably rugged vehicle and it's offered both in four-wheel and two-wheel drive. Uh, when the vehicle was first introduced it came in four-wheel drive only which didn't make a lot of sense but now they've got it where you can have it either two-wheel drive which is front-wheel drive or four-wheel drive. The Pilot's powered by a pretty efficient 3.5 liter V6 with 250 horsepower and 253 pounds of torque. It's a single overhead cam and doesn't have the same kind of valve setup as many of the other V6's out there but the result is that it's got good power, it's very reliable and it gets quite good fuel economy for uh, the size of vehicle. The Pilot comes with a 5-speed automatic transmission and it's uh, just a really nice vehicle to drive. It's a nice blend of being large enough to be safe and competent and carry a lot of stuff. And uh, being an SUV, it does have an elevated seating position, but it's not so high that it's a pain to get in and out of. The Pilot also has variable cylinder management on the engine, which means it'll run on either six or four or three cylinders, just depending on how much work you need it to do. It also has an eco light on the dashboard, which will indicate your fuel efficiency and tell you if you've got too much foot on the gas. The Pilot's quite a solid vehicle. It has a curb weight of from 43 to 4,500 pounds, depending on whether you've got the four-wheel drive system or not. Uh, it has a towing capacity of 4,500 pounds and so uh, it will do some work and here you have an example towing a trailer with some uh, four wheelers on it. The Pilot uh, is very smooth, drives well. It has eight passenger seating so all of them come with three rows of seats. The second row is 60-40 split. The third row is 60-40 split and both of those rows of seats uh, will fold flat into the floor just with one simple movement. The Pilot has some nice upscale features on the inside. You can get leather seating, uh, it has an available navigation system, there's an entertainment system that you can get for playing your videos, uh, you have rear air conditioning controls, you have actually air conditioning in the front and the rear two separate units so there's no issue with uh, overheating passengers in the back of the vehicle. The roomy interior is very flexible and it's very well designed. The Pilot's a very safe vehicle. It has Honda's very strong ace body structure. Additionally, it has airbags on all three rows. Uh, it has four-wheel disc brakes, which are uh, anti-skid ABS brakes. It has electronic brake force distribution. It has traction control. It has uh, stability control. It has tire pressure monitoring systems. It also has four seating positions with the latch system which allows uh, moms with kids a lot of flexibility as to where to place the car seats. Honda's done a good job in the new Pilot. It should sell quite well. Starting price is about $27,000. This is Kelly from Car Data Video.